I'll move over. I don't care if I'm in there or not. I didn't mean to be this long. Hello, Bonnie Curry. Mm -hmm. Yes, we are. So oh, so <laughs> uh, Here's your hair. Right As you can see, we're getting set up here. Hello, Amanda. You're always there. <laughs> Good evening. Are you hearing us? <laughs> Testing. One, two, three. <laughs> One thing I noticed, and I noticed it before, for some reason when we do live on Facebook, any writing that's on us is backwards. I got this nice t-shirt for my birthday. Can anybody read it? <laughs> we have a, an autistic uh, granddaughter, wonderful young lady. And... She and her mother sent us this t-shirt. There's an autistic young man that is selling these He's on the internet. Young girl, I'm sorry. And so, I'm wearing it. Uh, it's a little dark here in it. Let's see if I can turn on the light. That might make it a little better. Ah. <clears throat> That make it better? No, that doesn't make it better. <laughs> now you're frying this way, y'all. Hi, Kim. <laughs> Tell me what you want. Yeah, we are. That'll right. work. We are about three and a half minutes away, and when our grandfather clock begins to strike eight, we will start, and you should hear it in the background. Oh, there's Vicky. Hi, Vicky. I assume you guys can hear us. If you if you can't, I assume you'd tell us. <laughs> <laughs> Hopefully. It was a good day around here for me. I got out of the house for the first time in a week. Drove to the post office and mailed some letters. <laughs> no, he went to he went to network too. Actually, I took some food to network for Tiffany. <laughs> they they know us down there. Oh, Tiffany, you guys were here the other day. Yeah, we come all the time. 
we're going to relieve Letty Biedenhorn has been the only one taking it down there, so we're going to help her out here for a while. Oh, <laughs> I'm waving too. <laughs> <laughs> we can't see you. <laughs> Wish we could hear you and talk to you. Oh, about two minutes. You might be getting your prayer book out if you don't. We're going to start on page 127 in the prayer book. If you don't have one and you have an iPad available, you can go to the uh, Book of Common Prayer online, bcponline.org, I think. Might be .com. <laughs> <laughs> BCP online. Google that and you'll get it. Hi, Pam. By the way, I called church and took my name off the prayer list today. I had a very successful surgery for my deviated septum and I went to the doctor Wednesday and he had all these splints stuffed up in my nose holding it in the position, took them all out. And I can breathe terrific. I breathe enough oxygen now for three people. It's awesome. <laughs> if you need any, just let me know. <laughs> I'm gonna, I may have to try climbing a 14er when I get back to Colorado next summer. No, okay. <laughs> By the way, let me tell you something, if you don't know it while we're waiting. Uh, our good friend and current member of Epiphany, Ken and Neil, Neil Michelle, uh, has published an article. Uh, he actually published it on Facebook, and I shared it today, so those of you that are my friends will see it. It's basically on the pandemic and uh, how we should respond, what we're into, how it's impacting the church, and uh, his, his uh, take on... Uh, how we should respond and it's a really good article I think uh, we're really well done it's on Facebook by Ken and Neil Michelle if you're one of my friends you'll get it if you're not uh, I don't know send me an email or something and I'll, uh, I'll send it to you it's well done I've been fortunate enough to be a part of the 7:30 a.m. men's Bible study at Epiphany for many many years and for the last couple of years or so Neil Michelle has been with us and leading most of the sessions, and it's been it's been a real blessing. Jane Vineyard, all right, Jane. Except not Jane Vineyard, Jane Vineyard Laflame. <laughs> Welcome. Okay. Oh, the grandfather clock's turned off. I forgot. <laughs> We're not going to hear it, but it's eight o'clock, so we'll start page one twenty-seven on the Book of Common Pair. Prayer, an order for Compline. The Lord Almighty grant us a peaceful night and a perfect end. Amen. Amen. Our help is in the name of the Lord. The maker of heaven and earth. Let us confess our sins to God. Almighty God, Heavenly our Heavenly Father, Father we, have we have sinned, sinned against, against you through our own fault, in thought, thought and, and word and deed, and in, in what, what we, we have, have left undone. undone. For the, For the sake, sake of, of your Son, our Lord, Lord Jesus Christ, Christ forgive us all our offenses and grant that we may serve you in newness of life to the glory of your name. Amen. May the Almighty God grant us forgiveness of all our sins and the grace and comfort of the Holy Spirit. Amen. Amen. O God, make speed to save us. O Lord, make haste to help us. Glory to, to the Father and to the Son and, and to the Holy Spirit. Spirit as, as it, it was, was in the beginning, beginning is, is now, and, and will be forever. forever. Amen. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. Now we're going to just move to Psalm 4, which is right beneath where we were <clears> on page 128. Page 128 of the Book of Common Prayer, Psalm 4. We're going to read it responsibly by whole verse, and Susan is going to lead. Oh, I am. Okay. All right. <laughs> Psalm 4. Answer me when I call, O God, defender of my cause. Let you set me free when I am hard-pressed. Have mercy on me and hear my prayer. You mortals, how long will you dishonor my glory? How, how long, long will you worship, worship dumb idols and run after false gods? 
Know that the Lord does wonders for the faithful. When I call upon the Lord, he will hear me. Tremble, Tremble then, and, and do not sin. sin. Speak to, to your heart in silence upon your bed. Offer the appointed sacrifices, and put your trust in the Lord. Many are saying that we, we might, might see better times. times. Lift, Lift up, up the light of your countenance upon us, O Lord. Lord. You have put gladness in my heart, more than grain and wine and oil increase. I lie, lie down, down in, in peace, peace, and at once, once I, I fall asleep. asleep. For, For only you, Lord, Lord make, make me dwell, dwell in safety. safety. And now we're going to go to the shortest psalm in the Bible on page 131. We're going to say it because it often gets overlooked. Page 131, Psalm 134, two verses. Stephen will start us off with verse 1. Behold now, bless the Lord, all you servants of the Lord. You that stand by night in the house of the Lord. Lift, Lift up your hands in the holy place and bless the Lord. The Lord who made heaven and earth bless you out of Zion. Glory, Glory to the Father and to the Son and to the Holy Spirit, as it was in the beginning, is now, and will be forever. Amen. Lord, you are in the midst of us, and we are called by your name. Do not forsake us, O Lord our God. It's Jeremiah 14, verses 9 and 22. Thanks be to God. And now we're going to turn to page 132 and read another scripture. Uh, in the middle of the page there, 1 Peter chapter 5, verses 8 and 9a, 132, page 132. Be sober. Be watchful. Your adversary, the devil, prowls around like a roaring lion, seeking someone to devour. Resist him, firm in your faith. Thanks, Thanks be to God. God. No hymn. You seem they're not singers. I wish we were. We'll proceed there in the middle of page 132. Into your hands, O Lord, I commend my spirit. For you have redeemed me, O Lord, O God of truth. Keep us, O Lord, as the apple of your eye. Hide us under the shadow of your wings. Lord, have mercy. Christ, have mercy. Lord, have mercy. And now we all say together the Lord's Prayer. Our Father, who art, who art in heaven, heaven hallowed be thy name. Thy, thy kingdom come, thy will, will be done, on earth as it is in heaven. heaven. Give us this day our daily bread, and, and forgive us our trespasses, trespasses as, as we forgive, forgive those who trespass against us. And lead us not into temptation, but, but deliver us from, from evil. evil. Lord, hear our prayer. And let our cry come unto you. Let us pray. Second Collect there on page 133. Be present, O merciful God, and protect us through the hours of this night, so that we who are wearied by the changes and chances of this life may rest in your eternal changelessness through Jesus Christ our Lord. Amen. Amen. We'll do one more collect on page 134, the second one. Keep watch, dear Lord, with those who work or watch or weep this night, and give your angels charge over those who sleep. Tend the sick, Lord Christ, give rest to the weary, bless the dying, soothe the suffering, pity the afflicted, shield the joyous, and all for your love's sake. Amen. Amen. And now comes the time for some prayers. And you might look over and see if there's any intercessions. Yeah. There's usually not, and that's okay. I know you've all got them in your minds. And the thing I always like to pay attention to here, if you've been watching us on Thursday nights, it says silence may be kept. And we're going to do that. One minute of silence. You can pray what's on your mind. You can just be quiet and listen, be still in the presence of God for one minute, starting now.
Oh Lord, we pray that you would hear our prayers. We pray that you would answer them in accordance with the way that's best for us. We pray that you would be with us all during this difficult time of the pandemic. Help us to see the things in it that are good, the things in it that are teaching us new ways to live, the things in it that we should embrace and move forward as we as we live and move out of the situation we're in right now. And as Ken and Neil Michelle said, help us to embrace the different. In Jesus Christ's name we pray. Amen. Amen. Okay. Guide us waking, O Lord, and guard us sleeping, that awake we may watch with Christ, and asleep we may rest in peace. They will say together the song of Simeon, starting at the top of page 135. Lord, you now have set your servant free to go in peace as you have promised. For these eyes of mine have seen the Savior, whom you have prepared for all the world to see, a light to enlighten the nations, and the, and the glory of your people, people Israel. Glory, glory to, to the, the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit, as it was in the beginning, is now, and will be forever. Amen. Guide us, us waking, O Lord, and guard us sleeping, that awake we may watch with Christ, and asleep we may rest in peace. Let us bless the Lord. Thanks be to God. The Almighty and merciful Lord, Father, Son, and Holy Spirit, bless us and keep us. Amen. Amen. Well, okay. that was a record short one. <laughs> yeah, it was, wasn't it? Maybe I went through it a little too fast. <laughs> Compton is short and sweet, but it's a wonderful service. And uh, thank you all for joining us. It's been awesome. We appreciate it. And we, we pray do. that uh, God will bless you all this night and through the coming days and times. And will help us to see the things that are happening to us that are good that we should move forward with as we go downstream in this situation. So, with that, good night. Good night and sweet dreams. Sweet dreams. <laughs>